Hi friends, this is Audi1 and you're watching part 19 of the SQL Lab series. Well, this part is continuation of part 18 where we started to discuss blacklist filters where specific keywords were being filtered out. Today we are going to continue further with the series and we'll take up lesson 26. Let's open up the labs and go to lesson 26. In the previous lessons 25 and 25a we had seen that the developer of the application was filtering out the OR and the AND keywords and we were able to bypass it using the logical AND and the logical OR. In today's lesson, apart from filtering out the AND and the OR statements, the spaces and comments are also filtered out. Let's test it. Let's put ID equals 1, the default value, and we see the name and password on screen and the filtered output as 1. Let's try to put an OR here just for the sake of it and we see that it gets filtered. Let's try to put an AND and again we see it gets filtered. Let's put some space and put 1 and we see that OR AND and the space gets filtered and the result becomes 11 and it displays the 11th value from the database. To verify whether this is the 11th value, let's do this and exactly admin3 is the 11th value. So that means that our filter is commenting out or is just getting rid of all the spaces, comments, the AND keyword and the OR keyword. Let's try the inline comments and see whether they are getting filtered out or not. And yes, they also are getting filtered. Let's try the plus or the space in this form. And even that gets filtered out. So how to proceed with the injection? The basics still remain the same. We try to figure out how to break the query as the query for the injection remains the same for all of them only the blacklist filters are being added up so there's a single course that breaks the query and now we have to fix it so we can use the double pipe for the or and a single quote again and the query gets fixed so we see the info on the screen let's try to see if this is zero so the first part becomes zero invalid the next part or works let's try to replace this or with an and so we'll use the URL encoded value person 26 for an ampersand sign person 26 and you see the query is this and as the first part is a non or is not existent and the second part is true effectively making it a false thereby nothing is displayed on screen so if we make it one we should get something on screen and we get something that means our injection is working as anticipated so we have our left side, put it as 0, and we have the right side, that is this. If you see, although we have given space in between person 26 and this apostrophe 1, there is no space down here. Let's try order by, though it will not work. Why? 
why it's not going to work the very first thing is that we are using blacklist filters and if you see the first two characters of order by they are or and or is getting filtered as a keyword so if we do this you see that or gets filtered and only der space is taken off by all the space is taken off and this messes up well mysql is a very flexible database and it allows you to use different arbitrary inputs in place of the normal ones like instead of spaces we can use a plus instead of a plus we can also use some non printable characters which get represented as space at the back end how let's see to input space we can use a non printable character a0 percent a0 percent a0 percent a0 and let's not use order by because order by will fail let's use percent a0 percent 26 percent 26 percent a0 because this is an and statement so both have to be true so either one and one that means true or true will return true let's try to go further with it and let's try to see the union statement assuming that we are not knowing the number of columns being used in the query we can try to brute them so for the sake of bruting i am taking four columns although i know that there are three columns as per as per our experience from the earlier chapters but still let's take four columns and try to give space in between union and select percent a0 and between select and 1 percent a0 and our query works and because there are a imbalance between the columns on the right side of union and the left side of union so it throws an error message saying that the use select statements have different number of columns as soon as we fix this to 3 it should be fine and it displays the info if we go back and recall the initial videos to display the injection part we have to invalidate the first entry let's use a zero and as soon as we do that we get a 2 and 1 on screen try to recall the initial chapters again don't we think that there should be a 2 and a 3 being displayed on the screen well let's validate whether this one is actually this one let's replace one with four so in fact this one is not the first field what is happening here is that the later part of the query is getting evaluated as true returning one in the last field so in this scenario we cannot use the last column or the last uh, field to dump the info so only thing we can use is the second column let's use database and a security let's use version and it tells us ubuntu 
and I'm using MySQL 5.1, the default on Backtrack. Let's say user. So in this way, we can safely bypass the spaces, comments, the OR keyword and the AND keyword. Well, in MySQL, even parentheses are being used as spaces or if we use parentheses, then we don't need space. Let's let me show you that example on the back end. Let's connect to our back end mysql hyphen u root hyphen p password and we say use security our database and we say select star from users and let's build the query even further where id equals one and let's put a quotes around it to just display what we did on the web end union select one comma two comma three If we just enclose these, they would also work. And we don't need even this space at the back end. So in fact, we don't need any space. And we can get the injection going by using parentheses, or we can get the injection going by using some non printable characters like percent a zero percent b zero. SQL map has very good tamper plugins which demonstrate the characters that are being used. Let's check that real quick. CD slash pen test slash database slash SQL map. And let's go to the tamper folder. And we have some tamper scripts. So if you see, we have a script called space to plus that will convert all person 20, the free space to plus space to random blank. Let's check what is inside this space to comment space to dash space to hash space to more hash so if you go into these scripts you can understand what characters are being used let's try if this is the script uh, let's use uh, nano space to mysql blank so if we see here the horizontal tab the line feed the zero c the new page the carriage return the vertical tab and A0 are being used. So these can effectively bypass the space 
blacklist filter we can continue with the 26a lesson we put the same injection but it didn't work for us because the backend query is something very different and it's not throwing any user friendly friendly errors making it a bit difficult for us let's try different combinations or does not work does not work works so instead of an or statement we can use person 26 person 26 and the first part has to be one if we want to have some output and it shows us that our injection is working and now if we just say union percent a zero select percent a zero comma one comma two comma three and we have the same two and one on the screen well this is for now for this video thank you very much i would request you all to leave a feedback that feedback helps me motivate more and create more videos and improve the quality of the coming videos thank you very much a happy diwali to all of you bye bye